fucking chubbies. Movie where boglins crawl up your fucking ass and turn you into rapist zombies. Fucking love it. So, about these aliens that aren't allowed to fuck on their home planet. And their planet's very similar to Earth. And atmosphere and whatnot. So they come to Earth to fuck women to reproduce. Um, yeah, man, the aliens are the little fucking boglins from my childhood with the monster hand puppet things. Making me wish I still had my fucking toys, man. This movie was fucked. Absolutely fucking loved it. Non-stop laughs. Perfect amount of fucking gore and sleaze. Uh, I don't know what the budget was. I don't imagine it being a very high budget. And they fucking nailed it. I, the effects were dope. Dialogue was crude as fuck. And I absolutely loved it. Fucking Nathan Rumler in the goddamn Sasquatch outfit. Oh my fuck. Just everything about this movie. It was just... It was pure cheese and I fucking love it. Um, I'm going to get the link... Where you can buy some glasses. And this movie comes with those glasses for free. Um, you need this. If you're a fan of fucking horror comedies, you need it. If you like sleaze... You need it. Granted, there's not a whole lot of nudity. Uh, there's only one real scene of, uh, of a naked chick that I can recall from last night. But it was great. The fuck on, fucking neon orange pubes. <laughs> this movie was just a fucking riot. Oh, I couldn't stop laughing. Uh, I'm fucking... Brian Papandrea has like eight to ten different fucking roles in this movie. By far the best one is Rape Bot. <laughs> that thing fucking killed me. Uh, he's the judge as well, Judge P. Enos. Um, just the list of his characters was like this fucking long. And we have Nathan walking around in the Sasquatch fucking outfit. Uh, just, the characters were fucking ridiculous. The whole movie was fucking ridiculous. But it's one of those movies that's so fucked up, it's good. Like, don't come into this expecting a serious movie, because it's not. This movie is basically a bunch of dudes getting drunk, making jokes, and then making a movie out of those jokes. And it works. Fucking Lloyd Kaufman's even in this fucking movie as the goddamn president. If that's not enough to get you to watch this movie, I don't fucking know what is. Lloyd Kaufman was fucking great in this. Um, but yeah, like, if you're a fan of trauma, grab this fucking flick. This takes trauma crudeness to a whole other level. And... I have a feeling I'm going to be binging more of these guys' movies in the coming week. Uh, probably going to check out Big F and Gay for Prey today or tomorrow. So expect those reviews up as well. Uh, I've already done Fang Boner by Nathan Rumler. Um, that was a fucking great movie too. Uh, pretty much, if Nathan Rumler's attached to it, or Brian Papandrea is attached to it, guaranteed I'm gonna fucking check it out now, because both flicks of theirs that I've watched have been fucking nothing but gold. Um, I don't know what else to really say. Get the fucking movie. Just fucking do it. I'll get that link for the glasses so that the movie will be yours for free. Stay fucking sleazy, fucks. Peace.